my name is Tracy Allen and I'm just going to show you how to make hummus quick and very easy. And I'll just go over the ingredients first. Uh, first and foremost, you get a cup of chickpeas. They can be canned chickpeas, but if you can um, soak uh, dry chickpeas and then cook them, it'll taste even better, but canned will work in a pinch. So one cup of chickpeas. And then we have lemon juice, and so we've got quarter a cup of lemon juice that we put in. And then we use three cloves of garlic, and I've already pre-chopped them up, so I'll just throw them in there. And then one third of a cup of olive oil. Now, uh, two of the ingredients that we have is tahini, but we won't put that in just yet. And I'll put in about a quarter of a cup. And the other item is salt. And salt is pretty much to taste. Now I'll put a couple of, a um, little bit of squirts in there for the salt, but you can adjust the taste afterwards. So right now we're going to turn it on in a food, in a blender and let it mix up. And we may have to add water, so I'm just going to grab water. And what you're looking for is it to blend fairly smooth, so I'm just going to start it there. for the chickpeas to have not, um, you know, that they're broken up. They've uh, completely blended. This is the tahini, and it's half a cup of tahini. Uh, and tahini you can buy in the store, but if you like, you can make it from scratch. It's made from sesame seeds. So I'm probably putting them, I'd say, about a quarter of a cup of water, maybe a little more. Here, you can put some uh, olive oil on it and some paprika, um, just to make it look pretty if you want, but you definitely want to give it the uh, taste test. See if you need any more salt, or um, if it's too much tahini, or you want a little more garlic, that kind of thing. You can do that, but it tastes good. Enjoy.